Hello everyone, my name is Blindy, and today we're with a game called Presentable Liberty. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and tell you, if you don't like slower paced games, you probably shouldn't watch this video. This is, um, it's supposed to be like a really deep sort of game, kind of like, um, The Beginner's Guide, if you watch that. If you like something like that, you, you probably like this. So, let's get into this. Um... I don't know where else he would start from. Hmm. Uh, I guess I can't get out of here. There's a clock on the wall. Oh man, I hate reading this. It's like this font. Uh, my dear friend, I hope this letter finds you well. How is prison life going for you? Uh, it's prison. I know it must be hard spending. Yeah, I know it must be hard, especially in times like these. As for me, I will. Bleh. I will soon start another of my, I'm sorry guys, this font's hard for me to read. I will soon start another one of my journeys into the unknown. Wish me luck, Salvador the Traveler. Salvador, you don't just rub it in my face. Oh, another liver. <clears throat> Friend, I hope you are feeling I hope you aren't feeling too lonely in that dark cell. Just in case, I have put a little bug friend for you in the envelope alongside this letter. Salvador. I don't want a bug. Uh, it's a spider. I don't like spiders. Oh well. I guess it's better than nothing. We should give him a name. George. <clears throat> Dang, I love this font better. Good day. We are happy to inform you that you have been selected by me, Dr. Money. Dr. Money? I wish I had that name. To join an exclusive program for inmates all over the country. We have noticed that due to the recent outbreak of a terrible virus, the population of our beautiful nation has started dwindling. This is unfortunate, but this is still there is still hope for you. So, so there's like a, there's a virus, like a zombie apocalypse, maybe plaguing, which I do plan on playing that on the channel, by the way. Recent studies show that 98% of our great nation's population already is already infected with the virus. Incidentally, many of the remaining 2% damn are prison inmates like you we hope that you continue to be vigilant and remain healthy in order to fight depression and suicide thoughts the dire situation you have 
found yourself in, you will be assigned your own personal happy buddy. Enjoy. Oh, God. Hello, hello, hello! I am your own personal happy buddy. Trademark sign. I have a present for you. Five confetti poppers. Have fun. <laughs> confetti. We should probably save the rest for uh, occasions. Hello, my buddy friend buddy. Did you enjoy the confetti? If so, I have another present for you. It's a Dr. Money Portable Entertainment Machine game included. Oh, okay. Have lots of fun. Happy face. Oh, oops. I didn't mean to do that. Okay. We can play a game. Okay. Uh. Oh, okay. The controls are a little wonky. No. This isn't working. Why isn't this working? No. Oh, yeah. There we go. You know what? Who, who needs it? Who needs it? We'll just read this other letter. My dear friend, I have started my journey in the Far East with no goal in mind. On the road I met a nice woman who gave me directions to the nearest lake. You know how much I like swimming. No, I don't. And you know how much I like not hearing about your travels while I'm stuck in prison? Friend. The lake is beautiful. It is so peaceful out here. Have you ever been so alone that you yeah, that you cannot convince yourself to the fact that other people exist anywhere else? Salvador. Yeah, actually. Oh. Hey there, George. You kind of glow in this darkness. Press space to go to sleep. I don't want to go to sleep. There's a there's a letter, but I can't I can't find it. It's too dark. What do I? Give me the, give me the letter. Get get give me the. Fine, I'll go to sleep. Day two. Okay, so now we can read the letter. Friend, there is a present for you. It's. A point it's a painting that reminds me of the spirit of travel hope it will liven up your cell oh okay thanks hey buddy how are you doing I hope you're if you're feeling down, maybe a song will help. La la la, happy la la, glad to la la la, be alive la la. Ha 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 ha. That was fun, wasn't it? I hope you keep a song in your heart always. For you are smart and kind and important. Is that from the help? Good day, Mr. Smiley. Is my name Mr. Smiley? We have noticed that you have not met your happiness quota, Demerit. You will only get to see your daughters again if you manage if you manage to lower the suicide rates in prison. Wait, how am I supposed to Dear Blank? Why isn't he calling me Mr. Smiley anymore? 
We may have accidentally sent you a letter addressed to a certain Mr. Smiley. Oh, that would make sense. We want you to know that this matter has been rectified and that your happy buddy really does like you is your best friend simply because you're you are so friendly. Ha! <laughs> How are you doing? I'm feeling so great. You are my bestest friend, happy friend in the wor the whole wide world. Friend. If my calculations are correct, this letter will reach you at around bedtime. Well, I didn't, because I didn't get to read it. I hope the prison beds are comfy. Good night, friend. Rise and shine, sleepyhead. I hope you had a good night's sleep. I sure did. Hurrah! To celebrate the occasion of you getting up, I have sent you a second game for your portable and thing. Brain, I have decided to head north. Which is, as you know, my favorite direction by a very interesting... Oh, wait, I missed a line. It's my favorite direction. I pass by a very interesting river. A sign next to it read that the water changes the direction this time of year. I don't know if that's really possible. I guess it is. Fascinating, wouldn't you say? Yeah, I would say. I'd love to see a river, but instead I see these pixelated walls. I must stay here and witness the change myself. My curiosity is just too tremendous to resist the temptation. As much as I enjoy was vast. Sorry, this flying is crazy. As much as I enjoy vast uh, traveling and uh, something I can't really read that. Fascinating to blah, 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 blah. stay in there. I'm sorry, guys. Can't really. Ha! <laughs> I have another present for you. It's a poster to remind you to always keep a smile on your face. Oh, uh, good day. I don't think you know me, but from what I've heard, it seems that you and I are the two people in this town who are still not affected by the virus. I own yeah. I am the owner of a pastry shop not far from where your cell is. That yeah. But as I don't want to get infected, I cannot sell my pastries to anyone anymore. Except you. I would really appreciate if you could come down and have a cup of tea. I can't! I'm in a prison! By the way, my name is Charlotte. Nice to meet you. <sighs> my dearest companion. The river change is... The, 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 the river changing its direction is quite interesting to see. This is exactly what I have, I love about my travels. You always get to see new and amazing things, Salvador. I'm very sorry if I seem too forward and eager in my last letter. No, Charlotte, I'm, I mean, come on, I'm in prison. 
See, I haven't really talked with anyone. Conf I made you feel uncomfortable. I'm sorry if I made you feel uncomfortable. Sorry. It's, it's fine. Hello, hello, hello. I hope you enjoy your two games. They are expensive, you know. Ha 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 I didn't get a chance to check out my second game. The first one's really difficult. Fear of fire. Oh, I'm a bug. Uh, it's called fear of fire. I, I get what's called fear of fire. Okay, a letter. Ha 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 Please don't be sad. I know it must be hard alone, all alone in a prison cell, but you must remain happy. Please. And this comes to our, it has come to our attention that your happy buddy has been showing signs of not being excited and happy yeah. and excited behaving in an excited manner if you wish to have your happy buddy replaced please just send us a letter and we will get rid of him ah. hello hello ah. Hello. Heard that some people are reporting their happy buddies to Dr. Money. Ha <laughs> Whoa! That must be the That's really creepy. I don't I don't wanna look at you. You're really creepy. You know what happens to them, right? Do you? You wouldn't do that to me, would you? Ha <laughs> ha. Okay, he's really creeping me out. And what? Where did this picture come from? Oh, it's the picture that the happy buddy sent. Okay. New letter. I'm sorry I haven't gotten you another game yet. I just don't have the money for it at the moment. It's fine. It's uh, I don't care. George, where you at, buddy? Oh, there you are, buddy. I'm so sorry. It's fine. So very oh okay I I get it stop that we'll just we'll just play some fear of fire Games are hard, man. Ah. Friend. Is your bug friend keeping you company? Have you given him a name yet? Yeah, actually I have. Do you remember how we used to sit by the fires carving chess pieces out of wood with no care in the world? My wood carving has grown significantly worse, but I still tried to make you something to make you feel less lonely. It is a table leg 
a, a leg of a table, my man. I'm making for you. I know that might not be the most extravagant project, but I hope you like it anyways, Salvador. Aw, thanks, Sally. Oh! Well, hello, table leg. And hello, new litter. This is from Charlotte. It's a nice evening out, isn't it? I hope you have a nice sleep. So this is our cell. Wait a minute. Is that a... I can't really see her. But that looks like a door. And that door doesn't really look like... Day three. It doesn't really look like it's a cell. Hang on. I want to check that out real quick. See if I can see it better in the light. I have a letter. But I really want to check out this door. Yeah, that's a door. Look. Look at that. That's a door. And it's not a cell door like this one. What the crap? Ah, morning, morning. I have some very, very good news for you. You got replaced because uh, you're creeping me out. I got you a new game with the last of my money. This one's a real blast. Have fun. Uh, peace. Moon. It's like Flappy Bird, okay. Could do this all day long, guys. It's just really kind of hard because the controls are kind of weird. It's the only problem here, but I could do this. I could do this all day. Okay, yeah. I'll, I'll save that le level for later. Don't worry about me spending all my money. I'm okay. Just stay happy for me. For the love of all that is holy. Stay happy. They're watching. Who's watching? I don't... I don't get it. Okay, more letters from Charlotte. The world has become such a quiet place. So many people are dying. I watched them choke to death from my pastry shop windows. Dr. Money has started selling some kind of antidote, but... I don't trust him. I wouldn't trust no one with the name Dr. Money either. I will not leave my shop as much as the loneliness pains me. I need to remain here. It's okay, Charlotte. We're both trapped. I guess we'll play some more Piteous Moon. Just let me get to the other side. I 
think Flappy Bird's easier than this, just because of the way the controls are. You have to constantly, don't touch the edge or you'll die. Thank God. Oh Lord, I don't know how I can get past that one. How are you doing? I have been busy carving the second leg of your table. Maybe you eventually put a tabletop on it. I am I am starting to feel a little homesick. Perhaps it's time to end my travel. There have been incidents of people getting upset on how hard the game for Dr. Money's portable entertainment thing are. They are hard. No wonder people are complaining. Let's play some more piteous moon. How do I? This is impossible. Yeah, we're not we're not doing that. Where's my bug friend? Buggy, where are you? Spidey. Oh, got a letter. Please do remember, it's not about those games, it's about happiness. I don't care about the games, really. It's fine. They're... What are these? Am I supposed to try to escape out of here? I don't... Or just get letters. I guess I'm just supposed to get letters. I found this poster in my attic. I thought it might cheer you up. Then again, it's not very cheerful. Maybe you want it anyways. Let's see. Oh! It, it isn't really cheerful, but I like it a lot better than this guy over here, or that thing right there. Dear blank, Dr. Money is taking time off his busy schedule to personally tell you everything is fine. Well, thank you, Dr. Money. I'm glad we had that discussion. Looking at a pixelated clock. Looking at a pixelated clock. Da -da -da. Pixelated clock. I guess we could play some Fear of Fire, I guess. Did you get the doctor's message? I am increasingly concerned by the way he is ignoring the people suffering. The ins the antidote he was talking bleh, the antidote he was talking about is only being sold at a ludicrous price. He does not mean well. Where's my bug friend? Buggy. Oh, there you are. Hey, Buggy. Friend. The third leg of the table is finished. 
hug. Hooray, maybe? I don't know. Huzzah? Yeah, I think it's supposed to be huzzah. Guess that's what it's supposed to be. Heck if I know. Huzzah, I guess? I have also started my long journey back to my hometown. I would say I will probably arrive tomorrow morning. Looking forward to seeing my Oh, looking forward to seeing some familiar faces. The doctor has reduced the price of the antidote. However, it seems he can. It seems the course worries. Was it stops vital organs or causes vital organs to fail. People are more are now not only dying from the virus but from the cure. Let's play some more Fear of Fire. Most of my cakes have gone bad. I just hope all this ends soon. I'm not sure how long I can live all alone. I wish I could come visit you. Maybe I'll break out of here, Charlotte. Don't worry. I'll just click these wire things. I guess that's what they are. Oh, the third leg's done. This is gonna be a pretty big table, I think. Hey, buggy. And I have no body. Oh, I hope you are getting these letters. I'm guessing you just cannot respond. Now she gets it. Do letters still get delivered in times like these? I hope so. Are you even still alive? Yes, I'm alive. I'm right here. Friend. The one... Friend. This one gave me some problems, but the fourth leg is all done. Now, the last part will be there shortly. Salvador. Oh, this is going to be a pretty nice table. Are you okay? Apparently more and more inmates are killing themselves. Please don't do that for your sake and mine. Oh, hey there, buggy. This looks like a yin and yang heart thing. I don't really know. My dear friend, my good night present to you will be the tabletop. Now you finally have something to put stuff on in your cell. I hope you actually have stuff to put on it. Salvador, let's see. Oh, it looks nice from what I can see. It's pretty dark, but... Day four. Oh, the table looks pretty nice. 
I don't have as much room to walk in. There's a letter. Friend, my journey has come to an end. As you know, I do not have a family to come home to, but that's not what matters to me. I am just looking forward to the smell of my hometown. Oh, we have a table now. I think that's a good celebratory thing. I love how it just went through the table. Okay, we're out of confetti. Where is everyone? Oh, he doesn't know about the virus. Oh, poor Sally. Buggy. I guess we'll play some uh, more Fear of Fire. Morning! I sold my house, and my food, and one of my lungs, but don't worry. I spent the money on another game for you! Yay! Have fun, be happy! I don't want that! Do you don't have to do that! Triangle Wars? Oh, it's like Geometry Dash. And no, I probably will not be playing that on the channel because I suck, as you can probably tell here. But that's this one's actually a little easier. These streets used to be so lively. Now they are just silent. Why? Why do you do this to me? I have this old gramophone in my basement. Perhaps it's time to break the silence. Yes, that's that's a good thing to do. Let's... This is super hard, guys. Look at this pixelated walls. This game definitely has this feeling of you being alone. Like, just this isolated feeling. Especially since I am alone. Right now. Do you know what's going on out here? The virus? The organs? The blood? Do I not have a blankie on my bed? Aww. Mistakes were made. I, Dr. Money, want to personally apologize for the... In... The... the inconvenience that might have happened in the virus of our creation wow you created the virus please accept this frame picture of money as consolation what, what? money survives all hardship wow no it doesn't 
People are dying. Their organs are failing because of the antidote for the virus. And everyone is infected. I wonder if I am too. There seems to be a huge market of working organs now. Dr. Money has a big supply and everyone is rushing to the stores spending all their money but the organs are not what they seem was that pigs organs or something Anyway, why is the doctor's organ that? But bleh, bleh. anyone who uses the doctor's organ dies within three hours. Where do bleh, where do they come from? What are they? Does it even matter anymore? How much of the outside world can you hear? <gasps> Music! In your cell. How high are you even up? I guess I cannot know. Charlotte, I hear it! Wow, she must be close. This, this kind of makes me want to cry, guys. <laughs> Cause I can't go, this is so close, but I'm locked up and I can't, I can't do anything. And I can't tell her that I hear it. How can I? How can, where'd the music go? I like the music. Could you hear, could you hear it from up there? I turned it up loud, extra loud. There's no, for you, there's no better times than these for a little music. Yet I feel lonely. Of course, I could always play the music again, but is it worth it? It will never be the same. It would be great, Charlotte. I would love it. Because all I hear is silence. And a clock ticking. That one moment between all the dreary ones. Charlotte, play the music, please. D do me a solid, please. I like the music. Come on, Charlotte. This can't go on forever. Charlotte, stop talking like that, please. I don't, I don't like it when you talk like that. Just play some music. You'll feel better. I'll play some uh, this game. Play some fear of fire. I don't even know how many people are dead. I am afraid to look. I can only see what's outside my window and I see nothing but blood. Bye! I see nothing but blood. I 
think I am alone. You're not alone, Charlotte. I'm here. I'm here, Charlotte. Everyone is dead. No! The city's lights are going out. The town has no electricity anymore. The only lights are coming from the prison. One more day. One more day until what, Charlotte? Stop Stop it, just play some music, okay? We can we can Um We can I don't know. Can I not break out of this window? Or this door looks I can't crouch. Tomorrow evening. Until then, you must come. I can't come here. I will be here. I will wait here. I can't. I'm stuck in here. Charlotte, why don't you come here? Why don't you come let me out on the other side? If you cannot make it, well, I fear the world has no place left for me anymore. Charlotte! I want to come. I want to come. I do. I do want to come. I am awaiting your arrival. Until then, have a piece uh, yeah. until then here's a cake I baked for you I hope you like it I will love this cake because I don't know how long it's been since I've eaten anything that was a delicious cake Charlotte thank you Did you hear that wonderful music? I tried to head in its direction, but it was over too quickly. I am so tired. I wish I could tell him to go to Charlotte. She's alone. She needs someone. Salvador, go. I will just go to sleep in one of these empty apartments here. God knows there are plenty of them. I need to see you again, friend. You are probably still in that cell all alone. Tomorrow, I will come visit you, but first, let us rest, friend. Buddy! Are you playing your games? Are you happy? I am happy, but tired. Sleep, buddy, sleep. Tomorrow, it will all end. What? What will end? What are you even? I don't like this, guys. I just want out of the cell. Day five. I don't know what day five brings us. I don't know how many days there are. Goody, goody morning. All good, all fine. I don't care. I am not your friend. I was never your friend. Dr. Money blackmailed me. He kidnapped my daughters. He told me they would be safe. He told me they would be fine. They would be okay as long as I kept you happy. But he lied. My daughters are dead. They died from the virus two days ago. I didn't even get to say goodbye. But to you, I will- No, friend buddy, Mr. Smiley. You cannot lose hope as I now have. I have another game for you. I don't care about the games. I don't have the money for such expenses, but 
There is a huge market for organs now. I have already sold one of my lungs yesterday and now I will finish what I have started. I sign for them to take all of my organs money up front. I will not survive the procedure of course but that's not important. What you are one of the only ones left who are still healthy. Please don't lose hope. I hope you enjoy this game. I doubt it because it isn't fun. Like seriously, not at all. I hope you keep going anyway. Always keep going. Don't you give up like me. You you never know how you never know how much more time you have. Goodbye. No, I, I like no, my happy buddy. <laughs> Let's see what can we have? Crank? Is this all you do, seriously? It has come to our attention that your happy buddy has stopped talking to you. We would like to remind you that you are loved and that you must remain happy. Dr. Money, you suck. I don't like you. I want out of here. I want to go see Charlotte. Charlotte? Charlotte hasn't written to me yet. Charlotte, baby, where are you? Charlotte? Charlotte? Guess we'll play some more Fear of Fire. You are worth every penny. Go away, Dr. Money. I don't like you. I haven't got any letters from Salvador either. Uh, he stayed in that apartment last night. Is he okay? Did the zombies eat him? I really, It didn't really specify what kind of virus, so I don't know. If it's like a virus, like Ebola, or I don't, I don't know. Guess I'll play some more crank game. Salvador, it's good to hear from you. This town is dead. There is no life left in it. For all... Uh, I am... I am... Walking... Wandering these streets all along. I'm walking these streets all along. That's what he says. Okay. Let's play some more crank game. So is this like you're just cranking through life, just like dragging on? It's 
that what this is supposed to be a metaphor of? And it, and you have to crank this way because if you crank the other way, you're you're going backwards, and you have to go forwards. I am close to your prison. I am nearly looking. I'm really looking forward to seeing you again. You being in that cell all this time. You must still be alive, right? I might be writing to a dead man. That thought. Is kind of scary. I will not give up though. A little virus wouldn't kill you now, would it? I'm here, Salvador. Come get me out, buddy. Where are you, Sally? Listen. We have noticed that you're being contacted by someone with a measurably free spirit. We would like you to ignore all of his letters from now on. No, listen here, Dr. Money. Why don't you go suck my nuts? Tell me what to do. Crappy ass games that you made. Charging them for lungs and Shit, just don't even. I'm just gonna play some more Fear of Fire. You are being taken care of. You are being protected from the virus and the horrors of the outside world. Do not forget you are a prisoner. Listen, Dr. Money, why don't you forget? Go. We'll play some more Triangle Wars. I think I can see your prison from here. Maybe one or two hours now. I can't wait. And once I'm there, I will release you from your cell. This friend of yours, Salvador, he cannot be here. I do not appreciate the way he talks. I do not appreciate the way he is talking to you about freedom to you. This is no joke. Cease all contact with this Salvador. Friend, I have arrived. Where is your cell? Where are these letters being sent to? I cannot seem to even 
enter the building, all the doors are locked. I broke in, but the elevator won't work and there are no stairs. It seems that I have no way of getting to the high, to however high you are up. There must be a way. It is getting late, friend. Maybe, I don't know, to get there. That Maybe, I don't have to get there. Maybe, maybe you could come down here. I can't. I'm locked up. You know, this building you are in was never supposed to be a prison. There are no cells on the bottom floor. And and cooking looking at this place, there are no cells here anywhere. Aha, I knew that would have sailed one across from me. Dr. Money must have purpose purchased this building for locking you up, but why? Why would he do that? It seems so arbitrary, but no matter what matters is that the light on your cell door is powered by electricity, which means that if I manage to destroy the generator, you will be free to leave, friend. Are you coming? Yes, I'm coming. Please tell me you're coming. I am so alone. I am sorry, friend. No, Charlotte, I'm coming. He's going to let me out. So, Charlotte, no. Charlotte, no. God, no. Charlotte, I'm com I was coming. <laughs> going to wait just a minute. I have found the generator, friend. I only need to destroy this one. You will be free. Come find me at the entrance, friend. I am looking forward to shaking your hand. Oh! Your friend disabled the generator. Didn't work, really work out for him to, you know, it. Your friend is dead. They all are. Now your cell door may be open. But what do you think you'll be finding out there? You uh, just stay in your cell. I will send someone to fix the generator. And you will be able to stay at the portable entertainment center um, without a care in the world. I'll even tell you why you are here. You will never know that if you leave, you will be allowed to do whatever you want on one condition. Do not open that door. Yeah, I'm opening the door. I'm leaving. See ya. So, just a quick rundown because that was kind of fast and I couldn't read it all. But, um, Salvador got electrocuted trying to disable that generator. And what is this? Is that a lights? So now we gotta, uh, go. Uh, where do we. Where do we. supposed to go back in here. Oh, hey, bug friend. You can leave now. We were locked in the elevator the entire time. What kind of... Wow.
kind of spooky though. I feel like this elevator is going a little too fast. Salvador. Do we? No. No, they can't do that. Her pastry shop's literally right there. here can't even eat the cake closed Charlotte no <laughs> to my only friend If you're reading this, I will already be dead. My shop will probably be quite messy. I have decided that I will go to the back room to die so you do not have to look at my corpse. I'm sorry I couldn't be more patient in waiting for you, but that doesn't matter now. What matters is that you're here, against all odds, you've escaped the prison. I'm aware that this may seem quite uh, something and to uh, a bad ending to the story, but you're here. You're here, and I have baked another cake for you. I'm not sure how fresh it will be when you find this as for all I know you never will but I hope you enjoy it anyways I wish you the best of luck Charlotte <sighs> this is heavy the next morning What, did I spend the night in her pastry shop? At least tell me I ate the cake. Well, there's one friend that didn't abandon me. Come on, friend, let's go. <sighs> it's heavy, because, I mean, we we just barely missed... Uh, if if we could have gotten out sooner, we, we could have been there for Charlotte. That <sighs> It's a really heavy game. I identify it with it, though. Oh, God. Well, this was Presentable Liberty. If you did enjoy it, then please leave a like and comments and subscribes and all that good stuff. And uh, I will see you next time in a happier video. <laughs> Goodbye.